Howdy y'all, welcome to Lex Live. So I think it's time we play a little Minecraft. So, server's still down. I know it's been like a month now. But, uh... Well, not for Minecraft, but for my TPPI server, it's been down a month. And, uh... uh like I, I talked about before, you know, the company had a huge shake-up, so... Uh, they might be getting on track. I saw they were doing some work on some other areas, like other regions. They haven't got to the region I'm in, but, you know, uh, still waiting to see if we can get our worlds back. Uh, I will be starting back on at least Minecraft next week, and... Uh, possibly TPPI, I can start that over from scratch, whatever. Um, but, uh, you know, still, still hoping for DerpyCraft to come back. Uh, I was talking with one of the guys today, and, uh, he said, uh, he's not sure if he's gonna wait much longer, if he's just gonna start up a new server so we can get playing again, but, uh, this is, uh, the newest snapshot of Minecraft, 14W28B. Lots of bug fixes in this one. Uh, Mojang said that they are getting to the end of the 1.8 development, and so from here on out, it should mostly be bug fixes and optimizations uh, as they get closer to release date. So one of the things they talked about was, uh, well, they talked about a couple of things here in settings. Uh, under the video settings, we now have alternate blocks uh, based on your resource pack to be able to turn that on or off. And, uh, and then under resource... Oh, I guess there isn't actually a thing here under resource... I have so many texture packs I've played around with. <laughs> um, yeah, we're just going to stick with default today, though. Uh, but just be aware that that's under there, those settings. I'm, I'm sure they'll be useful. Uh, but what I thought we would do today is uh, we would try a little, I don't know, hardcore? Hardcore... Uh, I don't normally play in hardcore, but uh, we'll uh, we'll try it out just a little bit. Um, ooh, no cheats, that means no spectator mode. Uh, but I kind of wanted to look around in the world and uh, just see what kind of what kind of things we can do while we're on uh, on hardcore here. So I'm gonna create the world. This might be a really short episode. Five seconds. Dead. Uh, <laughs> it's been a long time since I played on Hardcore. Let me tell you. I'll probably die from, like, starving to death or falling off a... Sounds like they'd try to kill me off falling off a rock right there. Uh, good old starting out a new world of Minecraft. It's not every day I do this. I turned my volume down. Yeah, you're turned down. Must just have my headset turned up really loud. That uh, that was a cave sound. We must be near a cave. Uh, ooh, I didn't look. I was going to look to see if the grass textures are still here. Let me finish tearing down this tree. Uh, I think we still have the alternating grass textures. Let's see. Dark corner. Dark corner. Green, green. Yep, that one's different. So we still have the alternating textures. Uh, I'm thinking that that's probably the... the alternative blocks here. Uh, green in the corner, green in the corner, green in the corner, green, 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 green. Green. Yes, I would say that all our blocks are back in order. So let's switch that back. Because I, I... Whoops, wrong one. I kind of like it. I kind of like the alternatives. Are you a good bunny or a bad bunny? You're, you're a good bunny. Okay. Uh, you got to watch it because there's, there's an evil rabbit. And uh, I... I totally don't think we have uh, holy hand grenades to take them out. Uh, they're supposed to be really tough. Like, it's going to hit for 12 hearts of damage on hard mode here. And I'm not sure I'm particularly interested in 12 hearts of damage. 
Ooh. Whoops. Look at that mountain over there. That's crazy. It's like... <laughs> Seriously, do you see... Is, it, is that just floating in the air? I totally want that to be where I live. Get up here. <laughs> it's... There's just a giant floating hunk of rock over here by this uh, flower forest. Oh, you know what? I should have been looking for sheep. Man, I don't remember how to play Minecraft. You know, it's like all gravel, too. Look at this thing. Giant pile of gravel. Not sure I like this in the game. I don't understand why we get these big pile of gravel areas. Um, in my in my surfer world, uh, when we get back to that, because I have that saved, just I don't have the most recent work saved. But uh, in that, there's a huge section of just gravel. That whole thing up there is going to just collapse when you get up there. Alright. I should probably... This is weird. <laughs> Sometimes the random world generator in this just throws up some crazy things. Oh, that's a... I forgot... I am so used to playing in um, modded Minecraft that I forgot how many weird biomes there are. Alright, let's get us some tools. Uh, what is the deal? I don't know if my mouse is having a fit lately or if I just got too much stuff running on my computer all at once. I'm not... I really don't have anything running at the moment, though, other than some uploads. And that doesn't affect me playing the game. But sometimes it feels like there's like a a delay or a slide when I go to do something. Uh, let's get an axe, too, while we're at it. See, like right there. I right-clicked and nothing happened. All right. Uh, we want to get us some stone tools. I can't believe how many rabbits we've seen today. That's, uh... That's pr actually... Probably ought to kill some of them. Stop dancing. Really? You're supposed to drop food. I totally was killing you for food. Not XP. Alright, we need like 20 or so stone here. We're pretty high up too, so I don't know how good of a uh, haul we can get by starting mining here, but we shall have to see. Hmm. So, yeah, I was, uh, I was talking to JJ from the Derpy Craft server today. We were talking about uh, I hadn't talked to them guys in like two weeks, but did you see me switch back and forth between blocks there? But the, uh... <laughs> I just didn't have time last week with the 4th of July. And, uh... Uh, my... Brother's kids were here. And... Not that they're a hassle or anything. It's just, it's hard to, uh... It's hard to find a time when I can just sit down and record. I usually like to do it early in the day. Although this is, uh... Not early in the... Well, technically, I suppose 4 a.m. is early in the day. But, uh... Yeah, let's go ahead and get uh, an axe replacement here. And we'll get a shovel. And I'm definitely going to want a stone sword replacement. Okay. But, uh, you know, when they're in and out of the room, 
it's hard to uh, get anything done. And then uh, uh, Lego came over. Uh, Lego from the the other servers. Well, he plays on this server. Well, this, I guess we're not on the server at the moment. Didn't we see some coal back here? I was going to grab that. Um, but so he came over and his family lives in the area. So he was uh, hanging out for the weekend. Uh, it's it's pretty funny to me, but he uh, he will not... I'm not saying he completely will not, but he refuses to sleep on the couch. Uh, like, like I seem to remember one time telling him that uh, uh, the room, our spare bedroom here, was uh, was out of commission, and he could sleep on my couch, and so he he opted not even to come uh, here because he didn't want to sleep on the couch. And so when he comes up to visit his family, he doesn't go to their house to stay because they don't have a spare bedroom and he won't sleep on their couch. And so I'm pretty sure he has not come up to visit his family when he planned to because there wasn't anything but a couch available for him to crash on. And I find that really strange. Uh, when I was younger, I, uh, I'd spend a night on the couch all the time at my friend's house. Uh, we, uh, that was back in my MMO days. I haven't played an MMO in a while. I kind of wanted to get into that uh, Elder Scrolls Online, but I just, I don't have the time to dedicate to an MMO. It's just not happening. Uh, at least not right now. Not until I either get myself scheduled better or something. Uh, and then, you know, there's some financial issues too, but... I see you. Come on. Creeps a lot there. Trying to take out my... Hardcore life here? I don't think so. But uh, you know, I know some of the uh, some of the guys I used to run with in MMOs. They uh, they're overplaying that Elder Scrolls Online. I don't know. I uh, I tried it out. It's it's fun. It's just uh, this is totally not the story I was telling. I don't know how I got changed around here to MMOs. <laughs> uh, oh, these are in the wrong order. Let's get this stuff in my finger twitch positions. But, uh, yeah, they, uh... They apparently have a fairly large guild going right now. Uh, anyways, back to my story about... the weekend. Uh, so he came up, and, uh... Uh, the nieces and the nephew were here, and then, oh, you know, of course I've got the niece and nephew that already live here, and, uh, uh, so between all of that, it was just a struggle to get last week's episodes up, let alone get ahead of the game, and, uh, so, uh, my brother and his kids, um, they were here on Fourth of July, which was last Friday, and they, uh, you know, stayed for the fireworks. We had big fireworks displays. Uh, my uh, my friend, actually, the friend who I used to crash on his couch, he uh, uh, he bought a bunch of fireworks and came over with his family, and so there was definitely nothing going on Friday for me uh, in regards to recording because. There was, like, what has he got? Like, three, four, five kids, and then my brother's three kids, then my sister's two kids, uh, my friend Lego, and <clears throat> uh, 
my other friend and his wife and my brother and his wife and my sister and her husband and then you know me and oh crap I have I have hit the ocean oh I really did man this is deep swim boys swim Oh, and it's night time. Um, swim, boys, swim. <laughs> We're going back down here where it's safe. Let's uh, use some of these granite blocks to plug this hole here. Yeah, there we go. Uh, but, uh, you know, and then uh, my friend, he stayed till... He stayed till... Uh, Monday afternoon, and, uh, or no, Monday, I guess he left Monday morning, uh, and then my brother and, you know, his family, they were gone Friday night, um, but, uh, we just, uh, I don't know, it's, my computer is, like, my main entertainment machine, and so, uh, Lego and I wound up watching a bunch of uh, stuff off of Netflix, and so I just, uh, I couldn't record and watch Netflix at the same time, because, uh, I had to put the sound on, not my headset, <laughs> uh, and my headset, my headset, I think I heard it growl. I do, I hear a Ugh, I hear a baby zombie growl. That's not something I want to face on Hardcore. Actually, you know what? We've got... Uh... Oh, I left my, my stupid crafting bench at the surface. Why did I do that? I wasn't smart. Let me go get my crafting bench. Oh, no. Hmm. Where is it? Quick. Quick. Back off. Back. But, uh, so then... He leaves on Monday... And, uh, let's see, let's off behind us here so nothing can get us. And, uh, and so then Tuesday, I, because my Wednesdays are book solid, um, so Tuesday I had to record for, uh, Tuesday, or well, Wednesday, Thursday, part of Friday, trying to get ahead of the game here. And, uh, so then Wednesday, I'm busy all day, and... Uh, so now it's Thursday, and finally, finally feel like things are slowing down, uh, and I, I didn't really, well, I recorded my, uh, last Friday show earlier today, and so now I'm recording some Saturday stuff while it's nice and quiet. Alright, you get me some iron here, we'll get a new pick, I guess. This one's about to break. And I don't have any sticks. I am terrible at this game. Alright, well. Back to the surface we go. I've got to chop down a tree. But, uh... Yeah, so now it's, a. Uh, this weekend should be moderately quiet. Um, we did uh, we did spend uh, the weekend though watching Netflix, like I was saying. And uh, dang it, um, I'm gonna go get this rabbit. See if he'll drop us some food. 
They're supposed to drop some pretty... Duh, spiders, spiders. Some pretty decent uh, meat. It's like... Uh... Did you guys stop? Well, dang it. I was all excited to get these spiders down here because they couldn't get me. Um, but we, uh, we totally sat around and watched. Look, they're just up there with the, look at them jumping with the rabbit. Crazy buggers. We, uh, we sat around and we watched, um, I don't know, like, half dozen episodes of, well, it was more than a half dozen. Oh, it's a witch. Uh, we watched a whole bunch of episodes of, what is the name of that show? Twin Peaks. It's always on the suggestion box for my Netflix. And so when we were looking for something to watch, because uh, we usually watch a part of a series, and we were having issues picking one, and he's like, ooh, I've never seen that, but people tell me it's good. And I'm like, yeah, that's what I've heard. And Netflix is always suggesting I watch it, so... Man, don't watch that thing. It's terrible. I don't know who thought it was good. I did not enjoy it. Uh, we got... Like, okay. I th thought I was... Dude, I've been... Oh, must be chopping with an axe, maybe? I don't know, because I've been... Oh, oh, you know what it is? Because I tore down that wood before I opened my inventory. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know what's going on here. But, uh... I thought it was going to be good... Because everybody's like, oh, it's amazing. And then I started watching it, and it's a little quirky for my taste. But I can stomach through your quirk if the if it's good. And so uh, it's going, and I'm like, okay, it's just a little weird. Um, they bring on the, the FBI agent guy, who's the like one of the main characters. And uh, he pulls a... He pulls a letter out from underneath the dead girl's fingernail. And I'm like, ooh, it's a serial killer thing. All right, I like that. And uh, so they... Uh, so I'm like, all right, I can, I can maybe handle this. This is not bad. And as it goes on, it's just so weird. But it's got a... An okay crime uh, story. There we go. What'd you give me? Some raw rabbit and rabbit hide. Uh, rabbit hide can be used to make leather. Uh, raw rabbit is what I was after. They also drop a rabbit's foot that's used in a leaping potion. Now, see, that guy gave me meat and hide as well. So that first guy was just stingy. Uh, and so, you know, we're, we're watching it, and uh, we get all the way up to Season 2, where they reveal the killer of the girl, because that's the whole point of the show up to this point, was who killed Laura Palmer. Uh, and let's just say that there's no way you could have guessed who killed Laura Palmer before they got to that point, because uh, while there was a storyline that could have pointed to a killer, they just dumped it out the door and went with something totally off the wall. Uh, I, I really thought it was going to be a totally different guy. And I'm not irritated that I didn't guess, but uh, it's just too soap opery for me. You can't just change the whole point of the story just for the heck of it. Um, it's, uh, uh, I compare it to Frozen, and then people look at me like I'm crazy. But the movie Frozen, if you've seen it, you know that the one dude turns out to be a bad guy. But all the way up to that point, uh, he was characterized as a good guy. All the way up to that point. Not once did he do anything that indicated he was a bad guy. Not one single time. And even stuff that nobody else could see him doing, he did as a good guy. 
And so it's very out of the blue when he changes. And so it's totally not in character with the story up to this point. And that's what that's who the killer Laura Palmer was. Somebody totally out of character to be the killer. And the reason for it... Now, I'll admit, I stopped at the episode where they revealed it. The reason for it is totally insane. Uh, and makes no sense and does not fit in with the, the theme of the show. Um, although, honestly, when the FBI agent uses throwing bottles at a glass jar and whichever rock or throws, I'm sorry, not bottles throws rocks at a glass jar and whichever name is called when he hits the bottle with the rock is the person they should focus their investigation on pretty sure your show is dumb uh, so all you people who love Twin Peaks I didn't like it uh, but on the opposite side of things Oh man, we've got to get this rabbit meat down to my furnace here pretty quick. We're going to run out of food. Ooh, apples. I kind of want to go down and get that rabbit, too, while we're up here. Hey, rabbit. Give me your, give me your food. They're not jumping in my face like they're trying to attack me today, so that's... Uh, Seems like a good fix. Uh, now, while I didn't enjoy Twin Peaks, I did really like Knights of Sidonia. Uh, apparently, Netflix is now going to be releasing anime. And so, I mean, they didn't make the anime. They just uh, brought it over. Apparently, the season just finished in Japan and they already have it dubbed and released and so they <laughs> these rabbits are too funny give me your meat I need your meat uh, nope we didn't get lucky I wanted to see if we could get a rabbit's foot alright I really gotta get this stuff down to my furnace but uh, yeah that was really good and so I'm hoping Netflix carries on with uh, the anime thing because I really like anime and not all of that don't don't get me wrong it's you know it's hit or miss but when it's good it's really good and Knights of Sidonia is pretty good I wouldn't say it's the best anime I ever watched but it's pretty good uh, it's uh it's uh It's about a human colony ship on the run from, um, well, I, they're kind of on the run from these aliens, and uh, the aliens apparently have destroyed Earth, and it's been like a thousand years thereabouts since the ship left Earth, and uh, so they are still crossing through alien territory. And they, uh, they're pretty sure they're about to, uh, uh, be attacked again. And so they, uh, they have all of their children, basically, uh, you know, they try to get into the military. And, uh, so the ones that are in the military, of course, are special. And, uh... Uh, and they pilot these um, big mecha, uh, which is giant robots, if you don't know what mecha are. But, uh, yeah, it's, uh, it's pretty good. Uh, the, uh, the main character is uh, this kid who was raised... Did I just put my... No, okay. Who was raised uh, by this old man... Uh, in the bowels of the ship, uh, away from everybody. And he trained him as a pilot for the Mecha. And uh, because the guy is the only 
person to really take out the aliens in the history of human interaction with them. And, uh, so, you know, it's, uh, it's 12 episodes for the first season. I don't know if there's going to be another season of it or what, but it was pretty good. Uh, I rather enjoyed it. I'm going to check out the manga and see if I like that. I don't normally read manga. But uh, sometimes I like to check it out. What little bit I did check out of the manga, it's identical to the show. So uh, that'll be fun. Oh, cave. And I hear lava. This uh, hardcore stuff makes me really nervous. Okay. Oh, nice. We uh, we hit the top of the cave. Oh, dang! It's a terrible cave. It's a terrible cave. Look at it, it's got giant branches off everywhere. I don't like that. Oh, dang it, let him touch me. Oh, crap, 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 crap. Oh, dang it. <laughs> gotcha. Alright, so maybe I watch people play hardcore, and I might know a few tricks. Uh, wait, my health came back. I didn't think your health regened on this. I guess that's UHC mode. Totally not what I'm playing. I'm just on hardcore mode. Uh, which just means one life. <laughs> I was really nervous. I thought I was going to die because I, uh, I couldn't regen my health, but it came right back. I'm good. It's all good. Might be easier than I thought it was going to be. <laughs> uh, it's not as hardcore as Better Than Wolves, let me tell you. That skeleton would have taken my face off. Well, we wouldn't have been this far because I wouldn't have had any iron picks at this point. Alright, I'm going to... I'm going to seal this back in. I don't want to know what's up there. But, uh, yeah, it's definitely, if you like anime, it's definitely worth checking out. Well, if you like mecha anime, not everybody likes the same kind of anime. Uh, that's, uh, you know, it's like, um, what does he want me to watch? Lego wants me to watch Fate Zero. I tried to watch it. It's really not my thing, I don't think. I'm going to try to watch some more of it, but... Uh, I've never really gotten into the whole I have something that fights for me anime. Uh, I mean, I guess I liked Digimon a little bit, but like Pokemon is that kind of anime. I'm not. I don't know why I'm mining up all this coal. Um, Pokemon is not really my thing. But this is kind of like that, just an adult version. So, uh, it's... Apparently there's a Fate Stay Night. Or Fate Stay Night. I don't know. It's <laughs> Every time I heard Lego say it, I thought he was saying Fate's Day Night. But it's Fate Stay, as in Don't Go Anywhere, Night. And, uh... So I really thought, um, well, no, I guess that, that's just what I thought was they were saying. And uh, gold can come in handy. So um, I did watch a couple of episodes, and it's about uh, wizards have summoned this thing they call the Holy Grail, and it grants 
uh, the holder a wish. And so every... Alright, we kind of don't have a way down from here. I was hoping this would be... What is... Is that you bats? You guys make so much horrible noise. I guess we just pick a spot and mine down some more, because I'm not where I want to be. Oh, we picked a good spot, maybe. Looks like I hit a cavern and some iron at the same time. Ooh, we are getting down to the right spot. Oh, <laughs> tiny little cavern. But, uh, so they've got the Holy Grail. It appears once every 60 years in this city. And so every 60 years, um, seven wizards are chosen by the Grail to compete for... Okay, that's where I get a little confused. Seven wizards compete for the cup. The Grail chooses who's going to be there, but they have to summon the servants, which are the things that do their fighting, I guess. I'm, I didn't actually make it to a fight. Uh, there isn't a fight in the first two episodes. Well, sort of, but... Uh... So I'm a little confused as to whether they get chosen or the summoning does the choosing because they're we're gonna need this some point in the future maybe or not we may never see this world again uh, but uh, yeah it was it was okay I didn't I didn't watch very much of it though like I said two episodes um, it it almost my kind of thing. It's very dark. Very, very dark. Uh, like, it, it starts off with a dude throwing a little girl into a pit of worms that are going to destroy her. And uh, this other guy takes her place for a year in the pit of worms. And, uh... And then, like, the second episode has got this kid killing people. And that's his summoned being is a killer. Um, but, uh... Yeah, well, we've gone on... Oh, I've made it all the way to Bedrock. We've gone on pretty long here. Um, I'm gonna... I'm gonna head back up to, uh, my stuff. And, uh... And put this uh, iron in to cook. And then, um, uh, I think we were down here. I remember we came. Bats, you make so much noise. I should have marked my exit better. Oh, it's right here. Uh, <laughs> there we go. And, uh, and so maybe we'll come back to this, uh, and I will hold off on, uh, on my world while we try out some hardcore Minecraft because this isn't something I normally do. So, alright, click like if you like, subscribe, be sure and catch the next one. I'll talk to you later.